Welcome to Average Gear Review, where the best gear is the gear you have on. And what's up guys, it's your Average Gear Reviewer here. I'm back again with another quick little unboxing for you. Unpackaging, I guess, unboxing. In this one, uh, my buddy Will, the Nifi King, has sent us not one, not two, but three new pocket platforms to check out. Uh, I've got a special announcement coming at the end of the video. And also, I got a little Civivi knife from him that I bought from him. And uh, we're going to we're gonna check that out too. Anyway, guys, welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first video, thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate you stopping by to check out one of my little videos. It really does mean a lot to me. So without further ado, let's get into this stuff. So we're over here at the bench and as you can see i already have uh i've already got my pocket platform over here you can see kind of how i have it set up and if you haven't watched the uh, previous videos guys this we've been sort of through a little journey here with the uh, nifi king and he's come up with the really really cool what he is calling the pocket platform and i actually got him to send me a few more because I love this one so much. And he has sent some, and actually two of these are going to be, I'm gonna give them away in the 500 subscriber giveaway. So yeah, I'm super excited about that. And I, and I thought you guys might be excited about it too. Um, if you haven't seen the videos before, you can go back and watch sort of the evolution of, of these pocket platforms as he's calling them from uh, the original up to you know this this current version that uh, we're looking at and this is in the marine canvas uh you know you can tell this one is the one that i've been carrying this one's brand new and it this one also features the grommet that's a newer thing that he's added on still using the same velcro system on the front and uh, that's the marine canvas and then we've got a okay yeah this is the one i was super excited about the X-Pack. This one is in the X-Pack canvas. If you guys remember the original tactical front pocket, um, I'll try to put a link for that video up here. If you remember the tactical front pocket came in the X-Pack and I was absolutely in love with it. This is one that was special. I really, really wanted this one. This one's a left-handed version in the X-Pack. And these guys, these do feature a special feature that you're not going to get on them, even if you order them from him directly. These do feature the average gear review. This is the average gear, gear review version, basically. And does feature the red stitching and includes the grommet to hang your keys on. And I love these guys. Like I said, I've, I've been carrying this one in my pocket. It does not leave my side. And uh, I'm super excited to check out this left-handed version I'm kind of thinking I'd like to carry a, a little more on the left hand side and um, yeah and I also really really love this X-Pack version. The tactical front pocket was in the X-Pack and that's really really sold me on that. So anyway that was just wanted to go over those with you really quick guys because like I said these two are going to be given away in our giveaway. And uh, also I've got one especially that's going out to my buddy over at Surviving the Daily. Um, I've got one coming your way, Jeremy. So uh, I wanted to give you a shout out in the video and also let everybody know, if you're not already subscribed to him, go over there and subscribe to his channel so you can uh, check out that video when he, uh, when he puts that video up and we'll get his impressions on the uh, tactical front pocket there. I'm sorry, on the pocket platform, that's my bad. I'll keep wanting to add tactical to it, guys, and that's just my thing, so, um, you know, just, just ignore all that. It's the pocket platform. Uh, I did want to take a look at this little knife that I got from him too, because I was super excited to get this. It's always good to have friends who are knife collectors. And, uh, when they start, you know, trying to get rid of some of their knives or wanting to sell off some of their collection, you can, you know, Hey buddy. Hey buddy. Hook me up here. So this is the Civivi bow. I believe it's called. The bow, yeah. Dark green micarta handles has a stonewashed nitro V blade. It is such a cool looking little knife. It's a Brad Zinker design. 
if you're familiar with any of his work. It's a nice size little knife. I would say this is on the smaller, smaller side end of the EDC spectrum. You got uh, just shy of a three inch blade. About three and three quarters inch handle and an overall length of six. Let's call it six and three quarters. How about that? Call it six and three quarters overall. So uh, a really nice gentleman, like, like a gentleman knife size, I would say. Really, really nice looking green micarta on there. I love the look of that. It has a really nice texture to it, too. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you guys like micarta for a handle material? How do you feel? Um, do you like micarta or G10? Or are you more of a, a natural, uh, you know, like you like bone handles or you like titanium handles? There's so many choices out there. Um, but I'd love to know what you guys think. I, I am a big fan of the green, uh, this sort of rag micarta. It just has a, it has such a nice feel to it. It seems to really, really hold up over time. So, you know, um, we'll have to see how this knife holds up over time because like I said, uh, you know, I'm just getting my hands on it. But uh, I really appreciate you sending this out, Will. Super nice little knife. Uh, I like the action on it. It's just a flipper tab, you know, uh, sort of a basic little flipper tab liner lock. does have that uh, regular, you know, Civivi clip on there. So um, very nice little knife. I'm probably going to carry this around. I, I think this is going to get a lot of pocket time just because of the size of it. Uh, it's a little bit smaller even than the Elementum, I think. But uh, yeah, let's grab some um, let's grab some materials and do a little bit of cutting with it. So we'll uh, try it out on the old, um, we'll give it the old post-it note test first, just see how it does. I like using the post-it notes because they're a little bit thicker than uh, notebook paper. So, ooh, boy. Yeah, that is very, very sharp. Very slicey. Sure, it will curly, oh yeah, look at that, no problem. Very, very sharp little knife. And you can even see the edge on that thing. It just looks wicked. Got to love Nitro V Steel. Okay, so let's try just a normal sheet of notebook paper. Yeah. Not really sure. I think this paper is a little wet or something. It's not. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's just a uh, paper had a little bit of a wet edge on it or something. Just wasn't, uh, didn't feel normal when I was cutting through it. So uh, let's try on some cardboard. Okay. Yeah, a lot of times you just got to get the cutting mechanics of the knife down before you can kind of really get to go into town on it. But yeah, it's uh, tackling cardboard, no problem. So yeah, super sharp little knife. Really appreciate uh, you sending that out, Will. Uh, I, I really like it. Like I said, it's got a great action on it. I love how the action feels. It's so snappy. It's like a little snap, snap, snapperoo there. Snap, snap, snapperoo. And, and, you know, he was kind enough to send me all the accoutrement that comes with the Civivi knives. You know, you always get the little Elementum sticker, the uh, Civivi sticker, and uh, this one came with instructions for use. So, yeah. Never seen, I, mean, I don't think I've ever seen that before. It says, read this before opening the knife. So, I, I really screwed up. Um, did come with a nice Civivi case too. He included that and, uh, you know, a nice little fleece lined case. Good for, uh, storing this knife or other knives in. If you guys have had, uh, Civivi knives before, you probably have a collection of these sitting around somewhere. 
Okay, guys, that's about all I've got for you today. I want to thank you for stopping by to watch one of my little videos again. Really do appreciate you hanging out with me for a little bit. Um, you know, again, we did get the uh, little Civivi bow in. Super nice little knife, little gentleman knife. Definitely will be getting some pocket time with that one. And uh, don't forget, we do have the pocket platforms will be uh, included in the big 500 subscriber giveaway that we got coming up. And uh, yeah, Jeremy over at Surviving the Daily, don't I haven't forgot you, brother. I've got you one coming out. I'm going to get it in the mail just as quick as I can. So uh, that, that's all for today, guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you like the video, consider leaving a like. If uh, you're not subscribed, brother, I, I don't know what you're waiting on. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure that you have your notifications turned on so you don't miss any of our content. And guys, like I always say, Always be carrying, and the best gear is the gear you have on you. Average Gear Reviewer, I'm out of here. Average Gear Review, but the best gear is the gear you have on you.